you just watched me do the trigger work and the polish job on this A2. Now granted guys, I threw my A1 upper on here because my A2 upper is out being milled, but I'm gonna show you, here's the trigger job and it's fully functional again. So, as you can see, it's depressed. We're gonna rack it. Still has a standard take up in the safety. Let's see what we've improved. There it is. Let's pinch and hold that. There's just the, the trigger take up. Uh, about an eighth of an inch. Now we're going to do the discharge. Do it again. Alright, we're going to hold it and do the reset. Made the reset even quieter. Still got a really good positive pull. Trying to catch that reset. I don't quit bumping the camera. All right, hold on, here we go, reset. Well, there it is. I'll have to put the gauge on this one and feel it. I don't think the weight dropped much. Granted, this is a brand new one and I have not shot this pistol. Uh, or the, t the timing, I haven't actually taken it out, ran, ran it. I've, I've done the test fire. But you can definitely feel the wall is super positive. No more of that initial little take up. Everything is truly metal on metal. There's no paint, there's nothing in between it. It works. So that's it. Do the takedown. I'll show you what the inside looks like. And granted, that is using this A1 9mm upper. And I can show you here's this one fully polished. Done out. And I'll show you the difference on this A1 that has been shot. You, can, you can't even hear this reset. It's so light. It's right there. You can feel a little tick in it, but this gun here has also had a little over 5,000 rounds. And for anybody that is into the trigger resets or wants an audible one, uh, you're really not going to hear it when you're firing and running. The uh, You'll feel it, but the initial impulse control from the round going off will make you reset. All right, well, as you can see this one, I did a little bit different of a polish job. We stayed just with the top two rails, the ramp and the rear rails. I did not go down and shine out the whole center channel. Um, it's not necessary. It's still really shiny, but I just did the rail system. So I'm waiting to get my upper back and then I'll match everything to it and we'll finish this up. So. Stay tuned to part two.